Austin, Texas, the Texas Supreme Court on Friday dealt a final blow to a legal challenge of the nation's most restrictive abortion law. The state's high court said licensing officials are not responsible for enforcing the state's near-total ban on abortion, effectively ending the challenge brought by abortion providers across the state. There is nothing left, said Mark Horan, attorney for the Center for Reproductive Rights, which This case is effectively over with respect to our challenge to the abortion ban. The fifth U. As Circuit Court of Appeals in January asked the High Court to resolve a central question in the case and determine whether the medical licensing officials named in the lawsuit are responsible for enforcing. Abortion providers argued in court that state agencies regulating doctors, nurses, pharmacists and the health care system have an enforcement role that makes them an appropriate target for their lawsuit against the law, also known as Senate Bill 8. But lawyers for the state said the law clearly states that only private citizens can enforce the law through civil litigation. Justices on the Texas Supreme Court agreed, with Justice Jeffrey Boyd writing that the law includes emphatic, unambiguous, and repeated provisions stating that civil litigation is the exclusive method for enforcing the Act's requirements. Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton celebrated the states. Meanwhile, abortion providers decried the opinion as a failure of the court system, arguing that while the law has reduced the number of abortions in the state, demand for the procedure has stayed the same. This ban does not change the need for abortion in Texas, it just blocks people from accessing. The situation is becoming increasingly dire, and now neighboring states, where we have been sending patients, are about to pass similar bans. Where will Texans go then? Complicated legal battles over Senate Bill 8 have played out across local, state and federal courtrooms since the law went into effect in September. The litigation has fueled national debates about constitutional rights and access to abortion. Central to the debate is the unique enforcement mechanism employed in the law, which bans abortion after six weeks of pregnancy. Instead of creating a criminal penalty, the law allows any private individual to sue abortion providers or people who aid and abet an abortion in violation of the law. Successful litigants can collect at least $10, oh, oh, oh.